Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is the first episode of season four for Alpha 17. I'm um, starting the new season. I'm only three days in on season three. We did another update. Um, you know, I could probably try and go through the last game without restarting, but. You know, it's only been three days and I would just rather, I would feel better knowing that I started a new world and that any bugs I see are going to be from this uh, build, not the previous one. So <laughs> it just, I don't want to come into any compatibility issues or anything like that. So because I did see in the last one that Everything seemed fine except I couldn't regain my max health. For some reason, bandages, first aid bandages, nothing would bring my max health back up. It would heal me, but it wouldn't bring my max health up. So that was bad. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and start this map. We're calling it Alpha 17, the fun pimps, just like before, but instead of season 3, it's season 4. And this time it's putting us in the Gallo Mountains. See, I don't know if these are pre-generated maps or if they're just random names for it. I have no idea. Uh, but it's the same settings as we've done for all of the other ones. I did put this... Uh, it seems to me like the run isn't as fast as they can move. So I put um, the zombie night speed as sprint, which is it seems like it's faster than the run. <laughs> but the zombie ferals, <laughs> they can only run. And dealing with the horde knight, I put them just on run because, uh, yeah. So we're going to go ahead and hit the start button. I'm going to pause the video while it's loading because it's going to take a while. And I'm going to go have a cup of coffee, uh, make a cup of coffee, have a, some breakfast, um, watch a movie. <laughs> Just kidding. It doesn't take that long, but it seems like it when you really want to play, it seems like it takes forever for it to load. Does that, does that happen to you guys? Does it seem like it takes longer? The more you want to play, <laughs> the longer it takes to load it. Let me know. Anyway, um, we'll see you in just a minute. Like it's been forever since uh, the first clip. But here we go, initializing world. Uh, now I was reading the patch notes and it looks like they have, they did do some random world generation fixes. Uh, hopefully we won't see any more floating POIs. That'll be awesome because yeah, that was a little bit frustrating going into a, an awesome POI and not being able to loot at all because it collapsed. So, uh, and and also read that they fixed the, the, they reduced the amount of food that you have to eat. So uh, hopefully we won't be playing seven days to starve. <laughs> we'll be playing seven days to die. <laughs> um, Oh man, we start in a wasteland biome. We got to get out of here because I don't want to get eaten by dogs. Um, and I need to check what... I know that's a buggy, but it looks really janky. Um, is that my graphics settings? Or... I thought I had to turn them up. I need to turn this down a little, though. We're going to turn this all the way up. Um, let's see. I don't want the shadows. Uh, let's just go ahead and leave that because I did see quite a bit of a... Let's make sure we're getting some good frame rates. 
around 30 is okay. Uh, so yeah, that's a little bit weird. Let's just go, the, oh look, there's a little bit of a desert. Um, we'll definitely want to grab some of that uh, yucca and stuff if we can. Oh my god, a paper already. That is nice. Uh, we're going to scrap that. Uh, we can't... I don't know that you can break that with your fists, but I don't think I would want to. Um, yeah, we're going to scrap that at first, too. Do these look funny? Does the grass look funny? Um, is that something in... In here, the grass distance is far. I got the water quality. Um, I don't think anything... I mean, the trees are on ultra. I think if it was going to... Let's see if we turn that up on high. Does that affect our frames? Uh, it looks to maybe have lowered a teeny bit, but it doesn't look like it changed how these... Maybe I just haven't seen a desert in a while. Uh, but we do want to get these yucca and some aloe vera while we're here. Before we skedaddle away from the spooky wasteland. Um, I think these are the ones that give wood. Yeah, so we need to make sure we hit those guys and pick up these little bitty small. Oh, these are awesome to loot early on. Oh, this isn't the one that I was thinking. It looks like a wasteland one, not a hard biome one. But it does have a sink with two pipes in it. Anything else? All right. Except for this small stone. I don't need to go ah! Look at that. <laughs> Freaking landmines. That's why. That's another reason to not stay in. Uh, oh yeah. Look at this. Let's get. Uh, make sure we get at least four. Four yucca and four. Aloe. That's at least one seed once we can make it. Oh, two eggs. No feathers. Um, that doesn't. That doesn't. Uh, yeah, everything looks weird in the desert. The the grass. It looks really cartoony. Uh, another bird's nest here. Oh, I have so many things to loot. I need to loot all the stuff and things. Uh, we need like one more yucca. There's one right there. Let's go ahead and grab it and then we'll make our bedroll. After we loot the bird's nest. Oh my gosh. Yes. We also need to loot that car. So let's make our bedroll. And while it's making, we'll go loot the car. Um, we need to get our stone axe so we can... Oh, ten. Ten bullets. Nice. For guns that we don't have. Uh, let's kind of, I guess, try to hit these. Uh, let's just place it down and pick it right back up. And I'll place it wherever we wind up placing our campfire. I like hitting those because they're easy, easy wood. Yeah, this grass looks really weird. There we go, stone axe. There we are. Actually, let's do it right there. Let's go back and uh, get this four block. 
Oh, we got two. That's awesome. So we want to make our bone shiv so that we can uh, skin an animal once we get to that stage. I suppose he on this way out of the wasteland. Um, I see a bunch of trees. Hopefully that we'll get out of the desert uh, by then. All right, this wants us to gather some more plant fibers for the quest, which we will do. I guess we can get more, more of the aloe. We just wanted to make sure we at least got um, these big cactus you can break get plant fiber oh that chicken's gonna die that chicken just died let's go get it great fortune smiles upon he who harvests the chicken from the cactus <laughs> oh, the cactus chicken excellent oh here's a little bitty tree just for me that'll be something we can harvest easily I guess we should harvest that cactus that ate the chicken. Uh, a little bit of stone. And a bird's nest. Some wood. Um, yeah, let's get the rest of our plant fibers. Oh, look. These are the wood ones. I love, I love punching wood. Yeah, these look really blurry, and I don't know if it's my something on mine. Is this supposed to be like that? I don't know. That just it just looks really, really blurry to me. Kill this cactus. Oh, we got a somber already. We did have to go quite a bit away. Oh, we don't have like um we don't have a weapon. Let's make these all of our uh armors and get to the next step. You just stay over there, Zombert. Eggs, that's what I need. That's what I, let's go across the road over here away from the Zombert until we get all of our stuff and things. We just hover over there and you can use the hotkeys. Although I read something in the patch notes that says, uh, you want to do those manually because you might they might get deleted or something. I don't know. Sounds crazy to me. All right, all right, Chumpa, I'm ready for you. Oh, there's more. Look at all these guys. Oh, seriously, that's not gonna help me. I guess I can break it down into the metal. Chompa! It's been a long time. Oh, and I've missed my first power attack. Oh, don't. No. Dude, they even, they even looked a little blurry. And I thought I turned. I don't know. I don't know. The cars look a little blurry. Um, oh, <laughs> I'm just a little bit wobbly. Uh, it's been like a whole day since I played. <gasps> Yo, 
do a sn sneaky little ankle biter. Oh, stop it! Wasting my stamina. Oh, sometimes they don't take a direct path to you, so they sort of zigzag. They're trying to come at you from an angle. Yeah, I don't. I don't understand why those look. They just look a little bit blurry. Did we loot the car? I think we did. Yeah. Yeah, I'd really like to get out of the desert. Uh, we have weather for what the oh no we got a snake after us those guys are so hard to hit haha -ha. got you you gotta aim for the fat part of the body we got a little bit of meat. This is way better than we were doing last time. We didn't ever see an animal. So we're just gonna go... Um, walk down the road a ways, I guess. Uh, gathering materials as we go. Look at that. We just made that club and it's already halfway... There's a car over there. Um, the road's got like a little curb, but I'm okay with that. I think we're, you know, it usually the curb is the other way. But that's okay. I hear a zombie getting butt kicked by a cactus. Oh look, a coffee seed. That is, uh, that is most excellent. There he is. There's the little ankle biter. Oh yeah, look at that. There's a little bit of forest over there. I see a POI. Is that like, um, gonna be the traitor? <laughs> awesome. He was damaged because he, uh, stepped on a cactus. <laughs> Once or twice. Um, what I want to do is repair up this and maybe get uh, some more rocks. So we still gotta, let's, oh, I saw the bunny, the bun bun, did you get, the bunny got at by the cactus. Oh, there it is. Okay, it's not at by the cactus yet. It's just getting damaged. Let's kill this rock and we'll start uh, doing the quest again. We'll make the wooden bow and the arrows while we're sitting here getting stuff for more arrows. Yeah, because we only have 11 rocks and you have to have rocks to make arrows. You have to have rock, wood, and feathers. We got plenty of feathers. go now we're to the wooden frames yeah it would be nice if um, they would instead of randomly just placing you throughout the map let's just make like 10 I guess uh, that they would actually place you closer to the trader so that you know cuz um, sometimes you get to where it's like two or three kilometers to the trader and um well i mean they may have fixed the food but look my stamina is already down i max 
stamina is already a quarter of the way down and it's only nine o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Maybe we'll just break this tier. Uh, scrap that guy. Pretty much everything is, everything else is uh, a necessity. Except maybe the gunpowder, since there's so little of it. We can't really make, make bullets yet. Yeah, everything looks really blurry. Is it just the desert, or is it, I don't know. There we go. Go ahead and do this little guy. Get this quest knocked out so we can see how far our trader is or what, dire what direction so we're not like moving away from the trader. I think I may have just heard a bunny's death cry. And we're going to place our bedroll right there over here and see if we see that bunny. Oh! Bunny? Bun bun? I don't... I don't know. It sounded a little bit further away. There it is! Oh, we got free... free bunny meat! There you go! These cactus are animal eating cactus. Let's just call them animal catchers. Awesome. Okay, so 1.2 kilometers away, and we got to go to the southwest. Oh. So that's not as close as what I thought. Which is unfortunate because now we gotta run all the way across the world and we're already like down a quarter percent or 25 percent for max stamina but we do have some food but no pot uh, so we, I guess we could cook the raw meat just make charred meat and have more but I would really want to waste it uh, because the charred meat isn't near as good as the bacon and eggs and it takes the same amount of meat. Are you sure that's not a traitor? That's definitely something. No, that's not a traitor, that's a POI. Probably a little bit more of a POI than I am ready for. I see Mr. Zombert. Oh, I didn't miss. I didn't miss with the power attack, but... Uh... That that was a scary rire. All right, let's just let's go. Well, okay, we'll kill her. We'll kill her. So she's on the way. She's on the way. So you can die. Lucky you. Oh, I missed. Oh, this is gonna be a horrible trek. Try and get a kilometer to um, and not die. I guess we could always eat. Oh, the great of vulture. We could always eat the eggs, uh, but they could give us food poisoning. Oh, and we want to make a bandage. That's right. I forgot about that. We just haven't seen any cotton. It's all in desert. <clears throat> Excuse me. Prepare that puppy up. 
Look at that. Oh. <clears throat> you see those buildings? Those are bit, really big buildings for us to see them so far away. Oh, look at purse. The backpack. <gasps> a can and some armor. Oh, that is amazing. But it's scrap. It's heavy, but, you know, it's better than what we got. Because that is uh, a chest armor, not a shirt. So we didn't really have anything on there. All right, I see you, ankle bite. Oh my God, there's so much loot everywhere. Look at this. A shotgun? Oh, heck yeah. Let's just make room for that. Oh! Yeah, you wait until I get... Ah, uh, stupid vultures. I hate vultures. Yeah, I'm looting to try and lure you down. They wait until you're, like, in your inventory. Hello, piggy. There's a piggy. We only have 11 arrows. Let's fix that. Ah, uh, I didn't load it. Oh, how do I miss? Ooh, good piggy. I'm surprised that he didn't hit me. Amazing. I'm surprised that that vulture didn't swoop down on me while I was fighting. Uh, we might go ahead and eat that chili and drink the water just to uh, make this trip a little bit easier. Especially since, you know, the water will help us regen our stamina faster, so that'll help. Oh, I need that rock, and I need this bird nest, and I need this rock, and I need you to die. I know I'm really trying to make this a little bit faster. Oh! Uh, every time I see these logs, they look like a dead pig or a dead doe. And I'm like, oh, free meat! <laughs> but then I'm disappointed because it's not actually free meat. It's just a piece of wood. <laughs> I'm hoping that vulture will get bored of me and go away. Oh! Lady! Please! Calm down! No touching. Everything's going to be okay. Yeah, I bet that vulture follows me the whole way. <laughs> We're just going to whack these uh, bushes and stuff. There's a garbage. Hello, lady. Is this your garbage pile? I would like to buy you some for three whacks to the head. Oh, there's a car. Excuse me, uh, Chumpa. Oh, three wood. Seriously. I mean, I guess in the, in the desert there's not a lot of trees. Oh, you look like, um, got a hangover or something. Yeah. 
Let's get this garbage. Garbage. One empty bottle. Excellent. This is just what I wanted for my birthday. And and I get it early. <laughs> Cause it's not my birthday. Uh, we really need to get some more rocks. I got seven. I'm gonna try and, uh, oh look, I can sort of see it, I think. Is that it? I think I saw it before the, is that it right over there? Uh, if it is, we're gonna need to sort of go to the left or the right of this valley, I think. Oh, look, there's some water down there. Maybe I should take in, uh, in the unfortunate case that we actually uh, don't get a pot. I might want to fill this little can up with water. And grab this garbage. Four nails that are going to get scrapped. Where'd you go? You gotta get scrapped too. Oh, get scrapped. I scrap you and I scrap you too. I gotta scrap all the things. This reminds me of the place in the Lord of the Rings where the monster jumped out and tried to eat everybody. So. <laughs> Let's make that a thing. Be careful when you go down to the water hole. There could be an undead uh, crocodile come up to eat you while you get in the water. Mwaha. So, oh, there's another one. Um. It might be easier to go this way. I don't know. This looks like a little bit of rough terrain. I like my world's flat and <laughs> featureless. <laughs> Easy to navigate through. Ah, oh, that vulture just is not giving up. Give up. I'm not gonna die. Uh-oh. I heard zombers. I think, I think the vultures should feed off of the zombers because they're dead. And then they should eat themselves because they themselves are dead. It'd be like, you know, the Billy and Mandy show when Billy gets turned into a chocolate bar and then he winds up being only a head because he ate everything he ate himself <laughs> oh kitties kitties please behave oh where oh is that the crater over there we're, we're actually still over 300 meters away. I'm hoping that that's it. I want to have a bear plant. Oh, we're out of stamina and I gotta fight this guy. Oh, the kitties. All oh, the kitties are fighting amongst themselves. When my kitties fight. Oh, look at that. We got skill points. And I've been thinking about it, um, now that the level requirements are gone, um, I think I might change my tactics because I was really trying to, I don't know, uh, I really wasn't in that mindset last season to, to where I could spend the points however I want them and then prioritize based on, you know, what is needed first. Uh, what do we need? Well, one of the first things uh, to survive we need um, to build a base. And to build a base, you need materials. 
the foundation of the base is going to be what keeps us alive. So if we can't gather materials efficiently, then we can't build a very good base. Oh, hi, Champa. So I was thinking, since there is no level requirement for it anymore, we don't have to be level 20 to get the forge. Uh, so I figure we, we go straight for the forge and, and get the tools necessary to, to gather more efficiently because, I mean, like, uh, the gun saves, they are, they probably have the best loot and we can't loot them if we don't have a, like an iron pick or I refuse to loot them <laughs> because it, just, it would take too long, especially with the new, uh, stamina usage. It, it would just take too long. And we probably would run out of food before we ever broke through. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. um, let's try to get to the trader. So we can then try to scope out a place, hopefully nearby, because I want easy access to our trader. Picking up the rocks, I'm picking up the rocks. Hello, suit. Oh, wait. Honey. Yeah, I really hated that uh, I am really slow to maneuver. I wish you could like feel it, um, you know, in the in the video. But yeah, it's when you're encumbered. Not only does it slow your movement speed while you're running, but it also slows your movement speed when you're uh, fighting. So like, uh, there's already, with Alpha 17, I noticed there's already like a debuff on your backwards movement speed. So you don't run uh, fast backwards anymore. So um, kiting the mobs is a little bit more difficult if you're wanting to run backwards. You have to turn around and run away from them with their your back being exposed to them. <laughs> I know it's horrible. Um, <laughs> hang on a second. And we are almost to the trader. Hurrah! There it is. Oh, and look, there's cotton. Yeah, this, this looks really blurry. Now that I see these cotton plants, they don't look like they did last episode. They looked very sharp and clear in the last game. So, I don't know. Did I mess something up in my... Is it the light level? I need to turn... I didn't... I wouldn't think the light level would have to do with, um, you know... The blurriness, like, oh my god, maybe it's just this world. Oh, I feel a sneeze coming on. So partial desert, partial forest now. But I definitely would like to get into the forest. And it looks like there are quite a bit of oak trees. Oh, I can't get you. Uh, versus pine trees. If there were more pine trees, it would be... Oh, we're just going to loot the garbage while he comes to us. Oh, helmet light schematic. <laughs> Yeah, didn't have a clear shot on his head. Oh, see, I wasn't able to turn around and get away from him. Um, 
because I was encumbered and now I'm I'm ill. Uh, well, we have a honey in case it. Where's the door? <laughs> we have a honey in case it turns into an infection. So I guess that's all right. There's a gore block up there, but I don't think we'll be able to loot it uh, because it's so close to the trader. Yeah. Uh, no can do. Scrap the nails, although I probably could have had a freaking box by now. Um, oh, see those seeds are more valuable because you don't have to replant them. So if I could find a hoe, I could go ahead and plant those, which would be awesome. Uh, friendly neighbor, check in your mail. Five papers. Uh, we got to get this trash because it might have something in there. We're selling. Uh, let's just go ahead and keep it in its base form. I don't know. All right, let's take out the trash. All right, I think um, let's go ahead and make up those cloth fragments. That'll clear up a spot. And let's go ahead and talk to him. Because <laughs> I'm really, really slow. And make a bandage. And that'll clear up. Oh, well, it actually it cleared up the cotton, I guess. Look at that. We have over 250. Let's go ahead and make some arrows while we're here. Because we have a whole bunch. Let's see if um, we can sell that paper that we got. I got just the thing for what's ailing. Oh, well, that's fantastic. Do you have any jobs? Oh my goodness. Oh, look. There's a 780 meter one. Can you do me a favor? Godspeed. Awesome. So now we have a job that's not too far away. So that's awesome. We can sell these glass panes for one duke. <laughs> one duke. Uh, this is eight. I also want to sell the brass because we're, we're not going to be making ammo. Where did the brass go? You can at least sell most of it. Get a little bit of cash. Oh, where's the paper? You can sell that. We actually don't have enough leather, even if we do. Great doing business with you. Come back and Let's tell your friends. Let's look while we're safe in here. Um, I want to go straight down to the forge. And the forge is locked behind Int level 4. Last it was Int 5, but apparently they changed it back to 4. So that's even better. Because now we only need to buy 2 three and four is worth two points boom hammer and forge boom so first day you can get a forge if you have leather so we need to does he have leather is it going to be uh feasible to buy leather would that be under like resources he does have leather, but they're 44 each. Wow, that is expensive. Oh, we can sell this paper too. It's only 15 coins. Hmm.
I'll sell price. You only get two for ten of these, so... Hmm. I am not selling my helmet light schematic thingamajobber. I don't really think we have anything else to sell. I would definitely like to fill these up with water if we can. And those will stack. Clearing up a little bit of room. Yeah. Unfortunate. Okay, so we need leather, so we're going to... come back sometime. Let's look. We're on the edge here of the desert. Uh, our waypoint goes up this way, so I'm thinking there might be a town up there. But let's just go have a look around. Where, uh, let's, let's loot his place and see if he has anything. We're still freaking encumbered so much. See if he has any working tool stations. Oh, uh, it's destroyed. Okay, so no help from there. He's got a car over here we can loot too. Which is cool. Seven more bullets. Huzzah. Okay, you don't have anything. You don't have anything. I think um, all the other stuff is on the other side. That, you know, like there's a cement mixer and a chemistry station. Oh, look, a desk. Holy yes, please. That's awesome. I don't think there's ever anything in here. Oh, she, she dodged my arrow. Did you see that? Give me my arrow back. She gave me my arrow back. Give me, give me back my arrow. <laughs> She's persistent. I'll give her that. Oh, she dodged my arrow again. Yeah, and I can't. Can't get my arrows through there. Okay. Well, I'm so slow. I'm not gonna go. <laughs> I'm not gonna walk around there to get my two stone arrows. Yeah, I've never seen anything in these little end rooms. Um, forge. Is it this one. Yes. Oh, it's not a working forge. That's okay, cause we can we can make our own. We just need to get some more leather. I'm pretty sure on the other side is a cement mixer and a chemistry station somewhere. Destroyed chemistry station. Yeah, we've had it one time where we come through and every single thing he had was destroyed. And then we've had others where we actually had some useful things. Destroyed. Everything is destroyed. Way to keep your place up to, you know, working standards. Bob. Trader Bob. Alright. He's like no help. It would be cool if he had a sink in here we could fill our stuff up with... Uh, we might have to set up a little campfire and cook some of that meat. Hopefully we can get a pot from here. Nada. Oh, there's a water. How's our water doing? Yeah, let's drink it. That way we can fill up the water bottle. Come on, pots. Oh. He gave, he gave us some coffee beans, of 
course it had to be the beans. We wouldn't want it to stack with our coffee seed, now would we? Oh, no luck on the pots. Well, uh, there are trash bins, but they probably aren't going to have pots. And we can always check, um, we can always check that vendor to see if, uh, the, the vending machine, see if they have any cheap, cheap meat. Because uh, in the last series, it was two per meat, so that makes it ten. Let's go check it out. I completely forgot. I know I'm hungry. Just chill, please. Oh, I didn't even use this trash can. Oh, look at that. Yeah. So it's it's cheaper to buy this than to buy like the grilled meat. But the grilled meat you have to like actually spec into. So we're going to buy as much of that as we can. We have the money to buy it all. Yeah, there we go. Now we got to do is go cook it. Um All right, let's get out and hopefully we're going to we're going to head on into um, the forest away from the desert <laughs> so hopefully he won't be an issue uh, yeah the, there's a POI but it's in the desert which way is yeah, this, this way is the forest so we want to go that way for sure to try and Find a, a place close by where we can settle that maybe has water. That would be swell. Um, what we should have done, and I can't believe I didn't even think of it until just now, is taken our water and combined it with the yucca to make it a little bit better. Uh, it would have been yucca juice at that point. So... Yeah, that would have been swell. Try to, oh man, this is, it's hard to stay focused sometimes because, uh, uh, you know, you just take, sometimes you just look like there's like a little valley or something over there and it just looks so beautiful. I just love the, love the stuff and things. So I, I'm just so curious as to why my grass is janky. I need to I need to fix that because it's really bugging me. Um texture quality quarter, but I can't that's as high as it'll go. I don't want the shadows. The shadows um are just View distance, I can't adjust. Tree quality is high. I, I don't know. Um, I don't like uh, the motion blur. Is it the depth of field? That did not help. In fact, it seemed to make it blurrier. The grass, maybe I should do normal grass distance. That didn't seem to help either. So, hmm, I don't know. Nothing I do seems to work. I don't like it. Oh, I, I thought I pushed five. 
Let's go loot this car, this garbage. Um, I think those mounds are like POIs. I'd also possibly like to go check out that valley where it looked a little bit rocky. Maybe there might be uh, some water over there. Three duke or bucks. It's actually worth more than three dukes, but I don't want to go back. Let's go see if that's a POI. It looks, it looks like a, a little, uh, flat, I don't know, not natural, like the terrain is sloped and it looks like it's a ledge. Uh, I can see some stuff, I don't know, hopefully we'll find something with some food in it. See, uh, yeah, this is ridiculous uh, that I'm so far down on my stamina. By the time I, you know, reached, maybe they should just put like a buff, a temporary buff, like, um, like you get for the temperature uh, for like the first the first day to where you don't go through you don't take as much stamina damage uh, just a little buffer there's like two or three trash over here let's check this out nothing uh, yeah, we're gonna scrap it because we're already covered Awesome, we can those stack and we can turn this into bandages and then that clears up a spot. So that's a cupboard. Oh and here's here's water. That's exactly what we need. That'll get us a little bit less encumbered. That's the cliff I was talking about. It seems a little bit now that I look at it, it seems a little there's a landmine in the water. It seems a little, um, crooked. Crooked is the word I'm looking for. Crooked is the word I use to describe you. Seriously, um, I think there's a POI up there. I want to, I want to stop and put a campfire down. I'm so tempted to, but... If there's a POI close by, we could um, possibly find a pot, make better food. Um, I think I might just make a campfire. Oh, I'm oh balls. Our stamina is tanked. Hold still. Do, could you stop moving just for a second? Right in the hand. I love it when I hit him in the hand. In the... Ah, I don't. Uh, oh, there's another POI. Um, let's just go ahead and make a campfire. We could put this torch back out and that would do some of it. Let's just make like a, gr a charred meat. Maybe two of them because I don't think they give very much. I don't think they give very much at all. Okay, let's get this stuff out. Um, what would be smart is uh, to just go ahead, make um, 
make a little campfire here. Uh, place down a bedroll, maybe a chest. Put some of our stuff in it. And this won't be like a permanent thing, just why are you wonky? Dude, there. Uh, just so that we can uh, not be encumbered throughout this whole ordeal because oh, this is so painful. Yeah, you only get 10 max stamina. If you make bacon and eggs, you get 36. That's basic, yeah. So uh, maybe we'll throw some of you. Just throw throwing everything in there. Um, actually, let's go ahead and cook up this the water cans too. That way we can get a little bit of drink of water uh, to fill up our thirst. Yeah, because we were way down on our thirst too. And unless we find a pot, this is going to be, let's go ahead and, while well, it's daytime, Fill those up. Oh, I can move. Oh, this is so awesome. Oh, we don't have enough time. So that'll be there for when we come back. I would definitely like to get more arrows. Yeah, I don't like it that these... I uh, want one of you. Uh, I don't like it that the flowers are all janky. And the grass and everything is all blurry. Uh, it was not like this yesterday. So I don't know what happened. That looks like a military camp. That shouldn't be that hard to clear. Oh, but this one's good. It's got a good kitchen up top. And it'll have lots of chairs to scrap for wood. So win-win. And I like doing the the top-down approach. Cool, we're at 90% hydration, but only 60% food. So I'm hoping, uh, yeah, I'm hoping we'll find, uh, there's usually a guy, some, well, not usually, sometimes there's a guy sneaking around up top. Can I break this without waking you up, sister? Actually, let's break this one so she'll have a way to come out and get us. Uh-oh. Holy shnikes! Guys! Guys! I'm gonna get this leather. Where are you going? I'm over here. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. And I'm out of stamina. Don't destroy my stuff. That's my food. Oh, nuts. Those guys are still over there. Everybody form a line, please. Single file. Nobody will get hurt much. Ah. I really can't afford the power attack. Because I only had like, I only started this with 60 stamina. 
I'm just glad they uh, left me plenty of room to kite them around. <laughs> Alright, that should have been everybody at least from upstairs. Oh, and they saved us the leather. Oh, I hear stuff down. Uh, yeah, we need to repair these guys. Scrap those. Um, let's go downstairs. Uh-huh. I don't have any points in my sniper. Come on. Where are you? I hear you breathing. That box looks weird too. It looks fuzzy. There's a guy over there under the desk, but I'm pretty sure I can't shoot through the desk. I'm sure the guy in there usually stays asleep until you bust open that door. around I mean we really can't get to this uh, um, little we can't do anything with it so what's the point oh shades yes please more damage for my bows some plastic Crash. Oh, a cotton seed. We'll take it. I know, I'm hungry. I need to go search upstairs. There's a guy outside. Let's go ahead and deal with him. I don't want him sneaking up on me. Oh, there's another level. Gee, a mini Christmas. What? You can pick up an office chair? Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, I hear him now. Oh, it's a biker dude. Hello, Mr. Biker Dude. Ah, oh, ankle biter! I did not even see you. Oh. Means I have to waste my first duct tape. To, well, no, I probably won't make a splint because they haven't been working. I guess it would be good to test it out. To test it out to see if it's working yet, but. Alas, I do not have duct tape. So I don't I don't really have the ability to test it just yet. And I'll probably Yeah, there he goes. Let's help him out. A lot of the times he doesn't wake up. But I guess we were fighting over there. Let's let him do the rest. And we'll get some stamina back. A 40, all 43 of it. Alright, now we'll wait. Hello? Is that your 
chest in there. Uh, I'll rushamboo you for it. I go first. Oh, I'm out. Okay, there is like, no. it would be nice to have block picks. And there's another zombie. You gotta be freaking kidding me. Let's, let's go take care of it. You want me to starve to death, don't you? Okay, our sickness went away, I think. Uh, didn't turn into a infection. Which is good, but we still got our sprained ankle, so we're going to be a little bit slower. Hello. Oh, she went to the dip sooner than I thought. Oh, we got to get some food. Oh, please have some food in there. <laughs> well, I guess it's better to poke in the eye with a sharp stick. Oh, you got to be kidding me. How many... Freaking zombies are gonna wander by this place. Nothing in the cooler. Toilet the water. A free bottle, so yeah, that wasn't worth doing. I wonder if they're going to go up the stairs and then come down. Maybe we should face the stairs. Because uh, we didn't plug up the hole up there. A trash compactor. <gasps> A trash compactor with some food. Give me that. Awesome. So now we can uh, actually loot the kitchen up here. Loot this leather. Uh, how much do we have? Oh, we might have enough to get our forge going. We'll need to make a shovel. See, this is what I don't, what I liked about the level restrictions. The refrigerator is untouched. Oh, the water will help. It's not the food I'm looking for. Oh, well, you got a pot. Yes. That. Oh, a pot and a grill. Okay. Okay, our, our situation isn't as dire now as it was before. We can't... We just got to get a point... So I think that point that I just spent, uh, or I just got from leveling, we'll put into the Master Chef so we can cook. So let's do that right now. So we can cook, uh, we can cook the Goldenrod Tea, which will help us. And we can cook uh, the bacon and eggs and grilled food. So, yes, that, yes, please. <laughs> we'll be able to survive to fight another day. Um, all right. Oh, there's our nurse friend. Uh, it's good also to get that beer. Uh, beer is so really well. Uh, Oh my, it's already 19 o'clock. Okay, we're going to get back to our campsite. Um, I'm probably going to have to... Actually, let's, let's stay here. Let's get up top. I don't, I don't really want to do this because... Uh... I don't like taking over POIs, and this one's really big, so... Oh no! Oh well. Oh, I can't reach it. There we go. 
<laughs> so now they can't get to us and they have to tear the whole house down. So yeah, we're going to go ahead and call it an episode here and we'll pick up next time. Just it, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, oh, we got to go back because all of our food is over there. Oh, I just thought of that. Okay, let's go. It's just over here. I go at least get our food. I guess um we can take the bed up there with us. Oh look the bird's nest. Get that water. Oops. Actually let's drink it. We have a pot now. We have two pots and a grill. So we can scrap these and save a spot. Also, what do we do? So we can't scrap this chair? That would be awesome if we could, but we can't. Hmm. Alright. Well, let's just leave it here. All right, we're gonna take our bed for sure. All of our leather, our meat. Um, let's leave. We definitely want that golden rod. Okay, let's look. We want to take that because we already have some. We definitely wanna take the eggs. Uh, that would be good for torches. I want to take this. Uh, the honey. Dukes. Well, I guess we don't really need those overnight. That in case we need it. Uh, I guess we could take that little bit. Those. Those. The vitamin. The beer. Shotgun shells, because we got a shotgun on our hot bar. Murky water. Oh, yeah, let's take this and we can extend our... I definitely want to take that. Okay. All right, so let's just take this. We'll, we can come back later for the stuff. Let's um, let's put a temporary marker here, quick waypoint, so that we don't forget where our chest is. Uh, was it this way? I don't remember. Yes, it was. Oh, okay. There we go. I'm just going to get up top there, probably first thing, make a campfire, get some food going, <laughs> and try to not hyperventilate. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and end the episode here. Uh, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time to see uh, if I can survive another day in seven days to die. Anyway, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.